What's up good people? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Isaac Insights. Thank you so much for your continuous support and good people. We are continuing with this house in Eldoret. It's ongoing as you can see. I had given you this part by the way. I've just started from here so that you can get the connection. I said this is the this is a simple three bedroom house that uh, one can build for those people who have low budget i believe this house its budget will be as low as uh, you may think so this house is just small it's a small house yes it's a three bedroom with a special sitting room but it's not that big like the one we are building in uh, in busia so this is the foundation for our foundation in this house as we will see we started with the bricks and uh, this foundation took around 25 took 2500 bricks so if you are building for your foundation for similar house we'll use uh, 2500 bricks please remember we used bricks because our client had stones machine cut stones machine cut stones can cannot be used for foundation we prefer bricks uh, than machine cut stones when it comes to foundation because machine cut stones are not uh, they are not good when it comes to uh, drainage so we used foundation we used machine cut uh, we used uh, bricks so so far so good we are we are done with the foundation as you can see in this video yeah, as you can see uh, hey. So this is the the slab. The slab was done after after we added more brick, more cause of the brick on that foundation that we have seen. We decided to go a higher step by adding one brick to ensure that our foundation is raised above the ground. And for those who are recording, 2500 bricks will give you that foundation, and then. For cement, I will give you the total so far. We have eight bags which we are still using and uh, the progress is good. So I will be giving you more, but so far you can record. Uh, if we will add more cement, I will let you know. But uh, so far, that is the, that's what we have. Then, so I will advise if you are planning to build, just have uh, those, uh, those number of bricks. For this house outside walling, we will we are going to, we we are using the machine cut stones. Then partition will be bricks. For so we told our client that if we happen to get uh, if we get uh, six thousand bricks, they will be enough for us. We do the foundation and then the remaining will do the partitioning. Ata zikibagi zingine zitaziba paleju. So this is foundation. This is what we call slab. In slab, I think this was, uh, it was done yesterday. This was yesterday. I didn't bring you this video, but this is how it's done. And maybe someone will ask, uh, it's just a small house. Why are you taking time? We are taking time because uh, remember this is Eldoret and those people who are currently in Eldoret they will tell you that rains rains there are doing wonders and this brings me back to what I used to tell you what I once told you that if you you you, you go a contract way it's always good because remember my team is there if I had been if I was being paid on daily basis it means that the client will have uh, will have seen fire because those rains for example yesterday rain started i think at 2 p.m that was the report that i got it rained for almost three hours they came back at around five to to do what they can just to ensure that uh, a lot is not wasted same situation but today they were somehow lucky and we will see the progress of what they have done today in uh, as this video comes to an end you will see because we are already we are already doing uh, we are al already doing the walling we finished the slab and as you can see 
here it is someone will ask the this dpm this paper is what we, all, we usually call dpm by the way after doing backfilling yeah, and then moram you you need to put this paper what is the work of this paper this paper helps your house to uh, any any water that may go through your foundation does not uh, reach your floor so unapata your floor iku baridi that is the work of that dpm inasaidia hiyo kuhakikisha baridi haipandi kwa nyumba for those who use tiles and even the normal floor that people always use so for dpm for this house we, you need two rolls two rolls are enough and then uh, ballast i will just advise that buy if you happen to buy 40 tons it will be enough so so far so good that is what is happening as you can see the slab is being done was done already as you can see this was yesterday work and uh, as you will see as the video comes to an end we have started the walling tomorrow we will be doing the windows but i have told them that i need it. i would like them to start partitioning so that we do it once so generally when it comes to slabbing this is what usually happens as you can see the veranda there is clear uh, but for this house uh, we don't have back veranda because of space but we i will be talking to my client if she will uh, see the need for back veranda it's something that we can still introduce but so far so good this is the slab it is uh, well done as you can see on this video eh? this is a simple three bedroom house it's not that expensive even as you can see this foundation see mambo mingi let me give you a quotation of this foundation 2500 bricks 2500 bricks if you are buying them for 10 shillings that is 25000 and then back filling you just need uh, 10000 is enough for back filling kununua ile mawe oh add 6000 for maram then add um, another thing add uh, cement uh, cement for this let's go with 40 bags 40 bags is enough because that's what we got there but 40 bags let's let's go with 40 50 let's go with 50 not 40 because they bought 40 before we reached there but uh, they added more so 50 bucks 50 the calculation for 50 sorry 50 50 times 870 currently that is uh, 43500 we had said 600 six sorry 6000 plus 10000 plus 25000 so for this foundation believe me you uh, you have uh, sand another thing sand for sand if you are doing that foundation alone i will advise just to buy a tipper ukuenayo mm, that is around 18000 and then but for for our client they have more because we will be doing plus walling so another thing that a gladiator 2500 mm. so the uh, dpm there are uh, two of them we used two of them that's a total of 5000 mm -hmm. another thing we have those d10 and d8 for veranda you can just add them for a veranda you need the uh, 10k will be enough that is uh, I'm talking about a slab, that slab alone, up to that slab. And then ballast, we need ballast by the way, so just put 25,000. So for this slab, this simple house, I will say that if you have a, if you have a total of 150,000, we'll do the foundation of this, uh, but labor is not here, so not that. So let's say, Let's put it at 200,000. 
if you have 200,000 will comfortably do that slab eh? na mambo itakuwa sawa sawa as you can see it has been done i will be there by the way in person to give you this video and also one thing that you 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 need to know is that uh, you look at the other side uh, it seems that uh, it's on, uh, uh, somehow lower but this side it's raised it's because of the slope of the land that is the determinant but otherwise welling has started and we are going and as i earlier told you in this video from tomorrow they will be doing the partitioning so that you can see the house as it comes up but so far so good my team is well representing me i'm getting the updates each and every day just to ensure that as as much as i'm away i am able to know what is required and uh, at what time and also update my client that hey listen this is what we want this is what we are doing and this is what we are doing next generally that is all about construction and we are still working you will be seeing this uh, house as uh, we continue but i just say thank you thank you my team if you have not subscribed kindly subscribe i think this will be your house if foundation is taking uh, approximately 200000 then it means walling may be cheaper because if i can give you for walling these stones we need 1200 of them 1200 for our client since it's in Eldoret, I'm hoping maybe they bought at six, 60 shillings or 65. Let's go with 65. That's 78,000. And then cement, you will not, uh, we, just, we need only 40 bags will do these walls, by the way. Then partitioning, we need bricks. Bricks will need around, we, we need, we have them ready. We need around 3,000 bricks for partitioning. So you can see how simple it is. Please stay logged in. And if you have not subscribed, kindly subscribe. Before this house comes to an end, you will have seen the house that is meant for you. Up to there, I say thank you so much. Mungu wa ubariki. Mungu wa bariki familia zenu. Na kila, na kila mutu, ile kazi unafanya, ifunguke, ile na pia unite ni kujenge. Thank you so much.